Well, I think with Prime Minister Modi, with Captain Modi, there's a lot of net practice. I mean, uh, there's, uh, yeah, there's, the net practice starts at six o'clock in the morning and goes on uh, till till fairly late. External Affairs Minister Jay Shankar invoked interesting cricket analogies during the eight Raisana dialogue being held in the national capital. The foreign ministers of four quad countries, India, Japan, Australia and the United States attended the Raisana dialogue together. He likened Prime Minister Narendra Modi to a cricket team captain. If you have uh, a particular bowler who uh, you trust in or you've seen perform, you would give them the latitude, uh, the you throw the ball to them at the right moment. You would trust them to to deal with that particular situation. And I think uh, uh, in that sense, Captain Modi does give uh, his bowlers uh, a certain amount of uh, freedom. I mean, uh, he expects you to, to take that wicket uh, if he gives you the chance to do it. He shared the dais with former British Prime Minister Tony Blair and former England cricketer Kevin Peterson. Making a witty remark, the Foreign Minister also alluded to the popular movie RRR when discussing the ties between India and the UK. You know, the, the most uh, popular film in India last year uh, was a film called RRR. Uh, and this was had to do with the British era and just, uh, I'm trying to put it delicately, you were in the nice, you were in the nice guys in the movie. Now, we also touched upon a range of geopolitical and national issues during the interactive sessions. In another discussion, he said that Quad is not a security grouping targeting any country. China has been suspicious about the Quad and feels that the grouping is aimed at containing it. Okay, so uh, we do stand for something. What I would not like to be defined as is standing against, against something or somebody, because that diminishes me. That makes it out as though some other people are the center of the world and I'm only there to be for them or against them. I don't think, uh, actually I think I'm the center of the world, but that's a different matter. <laughs> Jay Shankar also highlighted three big issues that the Quad and the world need to address. There are three big issues that the world needs to address and the Quad needs to address. And Quad can address, can make a difference. Uh, one, uh, more reliable and resilient supply chains. To the whole, you know, the digital challenge, trust and transparency uh, when it comes to technologies, the, uh, how, how do we live a more secure uh, digital existence, and third, connectivity. And I, you know, I do see these as three big issues, which in different ways uh, the Quad uh, uh, needs to uh, do together. Uh, and also do with, with other countries and I do expect that uh, to be a greater part of our agenda.